Hopefully this is recording. It should be, unless I broke something. Uh, we're doing something a little bit different because uh, I'm still trying to fiddle with it. You can see in the background, or maybe you can't, that I've been going for three minutes and five seconds because I'm sitting here turning on and off different programs to try and, and figure out exactly what's causing it to slow down so much. Um, on the bright side, it means that you guys get to see the seed right away. So if you want to play along, there's the seed. Now, let me just bar this down so it's out of my face and I can see the chat now and we'll figure it out. Now if the volume is kind of wonky I do apologize um, but hey welcome it's Isaac let's give this a shot. It still seems a little bit I'm gonna leave the clock up for a second oh no it's the black bean how terrible um, I'm gonna leave the timer up for a minute so you can just see what I'm dealing with what I'm dealing with here. Now, of course, everything feels faster. We're going, like, at 1 to 1.5, maybe? It's not a perfect transition from 1 to 1 second-wise, but it's close. And that's... that's better. It's been pointed out, you know, we'd rather have a full-speed game than a proper sound, which is what I normally do the recording in the other program for. So... I guess that's the sacrifice that we're making. Let's see if I can do this. Let's see if this works. Nice! So, uh, yeah. These are the sacrifices that we have to make. It's we either get a full speed game or we get good sound quality, I guess. That's, that's the choice we're making. Now, obviously, I'm not going to go for the boss rush this time, the gauntlet, because I've already wasted three minutes tinkering with things. And I did just do this on Isaac because bleh. So if you want to be all bleh about the fact that I'm playing as Isaac again and that I'm not giving the other characters their proper exposure, well, tell that to my computer. And as soon as it decides to agree with me, I love the girl. I love her because I made her. But she's a bitch. And she don't want to work. Oh, that did not go how I planned it to. Oops. So, you know, if you got a problem with it, take it up with management. Management doesn't care. Just like real life! Just like real life. Okay. So, I guess I can turn all these extra lights off now. Give me one second, since I don't... I don't have my webcam turned on, so I can have all these lights off. And I can get nice and comfy and fight Larry Jr. And I feel like everything's gonna be I'm gonna die a bunch now. Like, I've got a minus five streak at the moment because of reasons. Mostly because I'm not really, like, hardcore playing. I'm trying to get things fixed. And that means that, you know, winning the run comes second to making sure it works. Oops. That's gonna do a lot of damage. Thank goodness. Uh, but this is just the first floor, so I, I have plenty of time to make up for it. Fooey for no webcam, but good for comfy. Yeah. Hey, if you guys want to donate to the Buy Me a New Damn Computer Fund, then totally. Now, I wouldn't ever ask you to actually do it, so please take everything I say with a grain of salt uh, and assume I'm being facetious, because I'm not going to ever demand money from people. I mean, I do this 99% for fun, and I think that that's what it should be about. It shouldn't be about, you know, anything else, really if we're being completely honest. It really shouldn't. So, you know, whatever. <laughs> Let's see. Bad trip pill. I hope that doesn't count. Because if that does count, then I'm kind of screwed. Hey, Bobby Bomb. Nice, you got homing bombs. I like homing bombs. They're good guys. Uh, not that guy. Oh, look at him. He's stuck against that. That's awesome. Okay. So we can do this nice and quick and easy. I will pop that open. And since I did get another key... Cool. What is this? Hookworm. Zip zoop! <laughs> Give it a try for a minute. Oh, yeah, that's not gonna be a thing that happens. I will, however, fight this boss. Come on, fatties. So I've got my item room, I've got my boss room, and I can't blow up pin in one shot anymore. They totally nerfed that. 
What about Bobby Bomb? Oh, I set that down too soon. Damn. So Pin is now not... Yeah, I can drop trinkets. You didn't know that? Bobby Bombs now have wind-up keys just like knock off Bob Bombs even more. Well, that's the joke, man. Shit. And <laughs> that's the joke. They're Bobby Bombs. They're Bob Bombs. Okay, so we got a range up, and we did get a double one this time. So it's already... Oh my god, I'm buying all this. That's already a step up from last time. Uh, troll bomb. Mega troll bomb. Get away. <laughs> Alright. I am happy with how this is going. And yeah, you can drop trinkets and pills or cards or whatever you've got. You can totally drop those. By hitting the... It's the left control button. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna do this. Because I have way more than enough bombs right now. Justice. So that just gave us back what we lost and one cent. Yay, one cent. So let's keep exploring. Oh no, it's Envy. It's the Envy fight. That's no good. I don't know. I mean, I'm glad that we got Pentagram. Like, it's good to have a damage up, unlike the last run I did where I didn't get a damage up. So, you know. Stuff and also things. But... I don't know. Regardless, I'm glad I can adapt. Like, I'm glad I can... I, I don't just put my head in my hands and cry when I see that my computer is being a piece of shit. I'm actually, like, going out of my way to try and figure out what what the problem is and how I can fix it. And Yeah, I'm keeping Guppy's head. Why wouldn't I not? Why would I not keep Guppy's head? So, Secret Room is most likely right here. And it is... We discussed the fact that there are crazy new rules for that. Pretty fly. Nice. Let's try to do this. I like how I look with um with mom's heels and this devil business. That's pretty cool. The pact. I like it. Alright, speeders, don't care for. I I'm gonna hold on to the bad trip pill. Like just in case it still turns into a health up pill when you're at low health. I don't know if it does, but we're gonna find out. Oh. I didn't mean to take that. Honestly, unless I get something like Brimstone, I don't care much for the, the worm trinkets. Because they're just kind of obnoxious. They make it harder to hit things, and that sucks. Oh, psychic Maws. At least the Psychic Maws like, stay still now. They don't chase after you, which I like. So, oh, up. Oh. And there's a champion one. Thought you could get me, didn't you? But you were wrong. Okay. T butt penny. Alright, whatever. It is a butt penny. We're adults here. <laughs> butt penny. Cool. I like getting soul hearts. I really do. Red hosts are easy to kill. Yeah, it does feel, it feels so much faster. I love it. Like, I'm sad about not being able to record in my chosen program, but... Yeah, the butt penny seems really common, but I guess that's because it doesn't do much. It makes you fart on things, but... Meh. Farting on things doesn't do a whole lot. It doesn't. Like, as much as I want to say, hey, this is cool, it doesn't do it a lot. Because most of the time, if you're picking up pennies... Oops. The room is already clear, because you're not going to be running around picking up pennies to get yourself killed. Ooh, almost walked right into that. We've got infestation, so more flies for days. Let's calm ourselves down. Kill me some speeders. Oop, go away. <laughs> okay, so there we go. Got that. Got another fucking butt penny. Uh, bad speeders. <laughs> nice. The red host guys are not scary. And I like that. I like that they're not scary. So we know that the secret room can't be below this one because there's a gap there. And as we discussed in the last video, it, so it can't be below here either. Because there is a gap. And there can't be gaps. Isaac Mothership. Something like that. Six B-Lickers is a few too many, I think. 
Uh oh. Girdles. Oh my god, Bobby Bomb is crazy homing now. That wasn't just a little bit of homing, that was like zoop right into it. Double trouble monstro. Cool. Hey, kamikaze flies, can you do your kamikaze thing? I don't care which monster you go after, as long as you go after one. Because, uh, you know, whatever. As long as we win, who cares? <laughs> that was close. Ah! Shit. Alright, I can't take, like, any more damage. Because I'm already way low on health as it is. So what do we get? We get a latch key, and a, it gives us a golden key. You're so silly game. And we did get a double room. I didn't hear it, but we got it. We have a Krampus to fight. Which is fine. I'm actually hoping for a lump of coal right now. Trubs of... Oh, I was looking at chat. Sorry. How did that hit me twice? Okay, we got lump of coal. Because I, I, I wanted to keep Guppy's head, basically. That's what it comes down to. Trubs with the dubs monstrum man in my buffs. <laughs> You're silly. Ugh. How is it going, you darling streamer? It's going okay. Uh, I don't have, like, I don't know. It's weird. Because I've had to tweak several things to make this work for me. But tweaking several things is making it, it's making it work for me. So I'm in an okay mood. That is not the secret room, wow. I'm legitimately surprised. Okay, but now we're, oh. Oh, that was the butt penny. I was like, okay, so I just got hit a bunch. But I guess I didn't. Lucky me. I had a, uh, an interesting day yesterday. And then um, a kind of terrible night. But I've got Isaac, so I'm okay. I've got Isaac, so I'm okay. And I have enough money to go to the shop now. And a mystery pill, which is amnesia. Screw you too, game. Screw you too. So, to the shop we go, straight there. Uh, let's see, can we use this, buy this, buy this. Uh, let's shoot these. So we did get three pennies out of that, which means that we could purchase that. I don't have any bombs, so I can't blow that guy up. And I love the fact that we can carry an unlimited number of flies through rooms now. That makes my life so much better. Anyway, Piggy Bank will give us pennies when we get hit. So, that's a pretty cool dude. That is a pretty cool dude. I gotta get into the habit of saying what everything does again. Because there's so many new items. And even though they have much... Yeah, it gives you pennies when you take damage. It gives you three pennies when you pick it up, and then it gives you pennies when you get hit. It's a pretty cool dude, if we're being honest. So I need to shoot these guys from as far away as possible. Let my lump of coal do some work. Oh god, that's right. The dark red ones are globin' deads. They come back. Oops, wasn't down far enough. Uh, let's avoid the big rooms for now, just because. Careful, careful. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So we do have enough keys. We can definitely go in here. Get my reflection. Not bad. Because we've got all this extra, like, having lump of coal means that they're going to work awesome. Look at how big those things get. Bloody, uh, piggy bank and bloody penny would be infinite life. Pretty much. So we did have to go to this room, but that's okay, because we have these kick-ass growing tiers that get larger forever and ever. No, stop it. Ah, go away. So yeah, see, as I take damage, I get hit. Or as I take damage, I get hit. As I take damage, I drop pennies, is what I'm trying to say. It's just not coming out right. Okay, can't do that. So let's check out the boss challenge room before we go down. We'll just check it out. We might not go. We might. Let's see. 
By the way, hard mode should be calm. Not gonna get any fucking bombs or keys mode. <laughs> yeah, for obvious reasons. But that, that is hard mode, man. That is not worth it for a boss challenger. Oh, look at all the little poops. All the little poops. Okay, so... This shouldn't be too hard. We just have to worry about the medium poops flying at us. And with my lump of coal affecting my... My reflection. My plan. Get hit, drop pennies, pick up pennies, fart on enemies. That is a good plan. <laughs> it, it works, I think. Uh-oh. All these... Mega Larry Juniors and s other Larry Juniors and so many Larrys. I still like to call them sandworms because just their skin looks like it has the consistency of sand. And I know that's probably not the name of them, but that's just what I'm gonna call them until I learn them. I can totally English, I promise. I prefer the term moderate poops instead of medium. I don't know. I don't know, man. Oh dear, this is not good. This is a dangerous room. Okay, that was not as dangerous as I thought it was. That's a good thing. Because it was kind of scary. Oh, look at all these little poops. Okay, Tears Up is really good. I like it. I really wish I had the petrified poop in this room. Oh my god, look at that. Ask and ye shall receive. So we're gonna go back to the shop now. Medium poop sounds like you're ordering at a fast food place. <laughs> yes, it does. Alright, so that's pheromones. These are both full health now, which does nothing because I have soul hearts. That's okay. Let's check out this locked room. Hmm. Still don't know what that does, so I'm going to skip it. And instead I'm going to pick up the soul heart because I desperately need it. Let's donate some money. Yay, petrified poop. It's exactly what we needed. So I feel like this run is going a lot better than my previous ones, and I want to say that that's because I have it running at proper speed now. I'm going to say that that's the reason. I don't know if that is the reason, but we're going to pretend that it is. Taco Bell is a solution to petrified poop. Oh my god, that's terrible. <laughs> True, but also terrible. Horrifying. Even. Oh, I didn't use my guppy's head before that. I do need a Shylock, you're right. The the, the dark beggar is a Shylock. Which is a, a term for something, something, something. It's something in Hebrew culture, and I can't remember what it is. Uh, were you having problems with the game? Yeah, if you actually look at a couple of my videos, you'll notice that it's running at about half speed because my processor and my video card are not that great. So the game was... oh shit. So the game was running particularly slow for me, um, to the point that it was actually, like, detrimental to gameplay. Oh, I want that left hand. Let's see what boss we get first. We have Gertie. Okay. So let's take these guys out. There we go. Some helmet didn't get hit there, luckily. I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. Being alive. Staying alive. Like we aren't dead yet. So that's a good sign. That's a good sign. Alright, so health up and regeneration. Cool. Sounds like how the original Binding of Isaac ran on your laptop. Yeah. It chugged along for a lot of people. Uh, I'm taking the left hand, because I want those other two guppy pieces. Okay. Curse of the Unknown. Well, now I can't see my health. That's not good. Excuse me. Because I know it wasn't a lot. So I had two soul hearts. Monstro's tooth. Holy shit, it's a challenge room with an item in it. I'm not taking it, but it's a challenge room with an item in it. That's like the first one I've seen. It's the money lender from the Merchant of Venice. Well, it's a thing. Shut up. 
I was informed a different thing then. Which means either that... Uh, oh, I can't believe it didn't hit me. Which means either I'm wrong or that was a reference to that. Who the hell knows? Oh, uh, hold on. Oh yeah, and I have one red heart. Let's just pretend that I only have two hearts to make it so that I play safer, I guess. Basically an offensive greedy Jew stereotype. Yeah, that's... it's a thing. Whatever. Why was I told that... how did I think that? That would explain why that isn't the official name for it. But I knew it was a terrible stereotype, so... For anyone who, who saw it and is commenting already, vehemently, uh, my information was inaccurate and I apologize for offending. That being said, dude, lighten up. Religion is a little bullshit as it is. Just in general. Oh, is that the ball of tar? Nice. I was hoping it was that. Just religion in general is bullshit. Okay. It's a silly thing. Whatever, it's a dark beggar. It steals your health and... something. Gives you soul hearts instead. I don't fucking know. <laughs> ah, good stuff. Man, somebody's gonna be pissed off when they see this. They're gonna be like, you bastard, how dare you? And I'm just gonna... Oh, good point. If anyone that's playing this game is really offended by religious iconography being taken in vain, then you were playing the wrong game. That is a that is a good point. Okay, so this room could be horrifying or amazing. Depending on how it goes. Alright, let's do that, let's do that. Okay, oops. Uh let's check this out. Ah, it's greed, I thought it would be. I had a feeling. Yeah. So I do have slowing tears, which is a nice thing. Oh god. How much... Okay, so I still have soul hearts. Or at least I still don't have red hearts that I've lost. Doubt anyone who's strongly religious or is or easily offended is watching Binding of Isaac. Yep. Exactly. Oh, and then they walk onto my slowing spot. Okay, so I've already gotten the item room. This is the Depths 1, so yeah, I can do this. Oh, it's the champion version. Nice. Champion Monstro 2. Can't believe I got hit there. Oh, careful. Alright, I like it. What, wait, what makes this one a champion? He's acting just like the regular one. Except he only spawns two flies instead. So what makes what makes this monster a champion? Hmm. Confusing. So what do we have here? We have evil up and three bombs. Matchbook. Okay, so gonna touch that. More flies. Definitely taking Guppy's tail. No death lasers. Yeah, this is true. Shylock is not a Jewish name, nor is it known before Shakespeare's play. However, scholars believe it is probably derived from Shela, Jewish Shalach, father of Eber and progenitor, progenitor of the Hebrew people. Wait, why did I leave? I don't care about anything else on this floor. Shalach. Is that, is that how you're supposed to say it with the sound? Curse of the Unknown. God damn it, I still can't see my health. That's no good. Okay, so I'm terrified of this dingle. This big ass dingle. The merchant of Venice, Shadow, who's a Jewish moneylender who lends money to his Christian rival, Antonio, setting the security at a pound of Antonio's flesh from next to his heart. When bankrupt, Antonio defaults on the loan. Shylock demands a pound of flesh as revenge for him previously insulting and spat on him. That makes sense. But yeah, since he takes your hearts and gives you soul hearts, I think that's kind of the thing. That's what the reference is supposed to be. However, I don't know. I didn't make the damn game. Why did I walk onto that? 
I thought it was already down. God, I'm an idiot. Because I'm not paying attention. I'm too busy reading chat. That's the problem. But at least I got a soul heart back. Okay, red chest. Yes, not got the item. And I'm not stupid, so I'm gonna wait. There we go. So this has been your, um... Your, your lesson in the Merchant of Venice, I guess. I like how they bug out and he'll go in a straight line despite the fact that he's the Hollow. It is a cool name for a thing. Okay, so I got two pills here, and it does not look like either of them are bad trip. So let's see, this one is pheromones. This one is a mystery pill. Bad gas. I'm gonna hold on to the pheromones for a minute. Um, alright. Damn. Okay, sorry Mr. Maw, but, or Mega Maw. But you need to stop being a guy that attacks me. Hey, Husk. Whoa, calm down. Calm thine titties. <laughs> Seriously, calm them. So that just gave us another bad gas pill. Oh god, I almost walked right into that. So I'll hold on to the bad gas, I guess. Yeah, he does kind of inflate when he spawns. I like that, because it's it's they telegraph their attacks really well, so you have time to avoid them. Which is probably the best thing. Let's go to the small rooms first. Oh god, look at these guys. Whoa, calm down, buddy. So rather than go after them, I'm just gonna let this take its natural course. Uh-oh. A trite. What's this? Oh, it's another full health build. Okay. So I don't need that. I'm glad I have enough damage and tears to just kill these guys outright. I don't have to worry about it. There we go. Character is called The Lost. What character is called The Lost? I'm sorry, without context, I'm not sure which thing we're talking about. Oh no, make a troll bomb. Damn it! Alright, let's do another one. Damn it. Full health kill. You gain zero health. I can't believe that killed me, though. Uh, yes. Free Tinted Rock. The last character you unlock. Oh, well, don't spoil things for me, man. I want as few spoilers as possible. Because I'd been looking at that thing with... Like, they were talking about puzzle pieces or something on the subreddit, and somebody mentioned it, and I was like, Oh no, I don't want to know what the Lost is. <sighs> Damn it. Okay, so that guy gave me flies. Oh, I see. I missed that bit at the beginning. No, I have not seen that character. But I don't want to see it yet. Oh god, yeah, that sounds like a hardcore run now that I read about it. A never get hit run? That's That's painful. Let's see what this does. Nothing. Nothing. It does nothing. It's like the goggles. Oh. I th Sorry if I spoiled it. I doubt you you'd ever unlock without knowing exactly how to do it. Um, I was looking at the thread on the subreddit that was talking about it, but I didn't want to know just yet. I want to get everything else first. Or I want to find it on my own. I mean, I like... I like finding stuff on my own. I'm enjoying it being unspoiled right now, is what I'm saying. Because I am enjoying things being unspoiled. Because it's, it's fun to figure out what things do on their own. Oh, I think he gave me a soul heart. I think that's what it did. Which is fine. I didn't want one, but I think that's what it did. 
It was the Book of Revelations. That's what it was. It gave me the Book of Revelations effect. So I probably wouldn't have fought Famine if I hadn't used it already. Good to know that that actually does cause... Like, when you use it and it gives you the Book of Revelations effect, it actually does... It counts as the Book of Revelations for forcing a horseman fight. Cool! Yeah, I missed the jingle, too. Alright, so Ball of Bandages is definitely a thing. We're gonna hold off on picking that up for a moment. Did I explore this whole floor? I think I did. Let's check. Nope. Yeah, I didn't think that was it. So where else could it be? Hmm. Maybe if it's the top secret room, too. Okay. Okay, I'm stumped. We're just gonna leave. So I don't have any keys. I can't go into whatever the not... Uh, the knot shop is. Taking that. Let's get out of here. But no, I like figuring stuff out myself. Like when I got my second, um... Let's see what this one does. That's London Mishap. When I got my second ball of bandages and I figured out, oh, she shoots pheromone tears. That was cool to discover myself. Oh, crap. I don't like this room. I didn't like it in the original. I don't like it now. Okay, cool. Let's see what happens. Oh, Tammy's head. Is a pretty cool effect. Nowadays. Like, it wasn't ever a bad effect. It just wasn't as good in the original. It was good, just not as good. Ah, yeah, that guy jumped into the fire. He was flaming poop for a second. Which is hilarious. I'm not gonna open that unless I find a key. Because I need to save it for my item room. Which is right here, yay! Oh, no, go away. Bad traits. Yeah, the electric guitar riffs are badass in this. I love the music. Okay, so I haven't gotten this one yet. Let's use this really quick. That was, uh, the card of, you know, gave us a card. Mom's eyeshadow. Charm tears. Oh, look at him. Isn't he pretty? With his makeup and stuff. So I guess this is a chance for fair moons naturally. Yes, it is. What do we have here? Two of hearts. I'll hold on to that. For later. So charm, charm tears, cool. It, wait, is charm different from pheromones? I don't know. So she doesn't shoot pheromones; she shoots charm tears, which makes a lot of sense. Go away. Oh, we're fighting Pin again. Interesting. That is a, not a bad effect to get if it's the one I think it is. I don't know what the hell effect this is. It's not Horror Babylon. What the fuck is it? It's not Brimstone, that's obvious. Jesus Juice is good. Oh, it was the nail! Okay, thanks game. So I'm not gonna take- actually, you know what? I am gonna take this. Because I got that soul heart, I'm gonna take this. Wait, why are we growing- oh, Isaac is now charming. Yeah, yeah, some of our viewers like to make puns. Fabulous. Yes, I definitely meant fabulous. Yeah, it was the nail effect. As soon as I realized that I had a soul heart, I figured out what it was. Okay, so that was the... Cool. Cool. I like that. Let's blow these guys up. Because blowing up mushrooms is awesome. Luck up, really nice. So luck up affects a lot more things in the same way that it did... Oh god, look at all these poops. Luck up affects um, pretty much all the shot things now instead of just uh, tough love. So we now have like a... Come on, keep shooting. So we'll now have a 2 in 10 chance, most likely, instead of a 1 in 10 chance, most likely, to get our charm tears. Which is good, that's awesome! And yeah, I'm totally shooting this entire room of poop. 
and you just have to deal with it. Pharmaceuticals come from mushrooms. Some do. It's like, um, it's like, what's his name? There's a comedian who had a rant about that. It's like, you know what they call, I could totally take that, but I'm not gonna. You know what they call alternative medicine that's proved to work? Medicine. So mushrooms that are like that are just, they're just medicine. They're just regular old pharmaceutical. Okay, let's get out of here. So, looks like we're just about ahead of the timer, I'm like right on track for it, and now I can, I can chill out over rocks and not take damage, which is always a fun thing to do. It is a thing that saves my ass a lot of the time. Cool. Okay, so we've done that. I'm just gonna hang out up here where they can't get me. So does insanity and death. Yes. And delicious pizza toppings. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of mushroom pizza, to be completely honest. Alright, what's in here? Okay, is that chocolate milk? That might be chocolate milk. It looks a little orangey to be chocolate milk, but we're gonna... It is chocolate milk. Alright, so we can charge your shots, which means that I'm gonna end up mashing. What is this? I don't know what effect- oh, it gave me the nail again. Which is good, because that means I got another soul heart. There is no pizza without mushrooms. I will take, um, sausage and pepperoni, and extra cheese, and maybe bacon if I'm feeling it. Maybe bacon if I'm feeling it. I mean, bacon is delicious, but as a, a pizza topping, it's usually a little bit too... I don't know. A little bit too chewy for me as a pizza topping. They really got to do it just right to get it. Why are we talking about pizza, for God's sake? So let's see what we got in here. I slowed everything, and it looks like that slows music, too. So you're going to have to deal with me spamming for a moment. It's a giant mushroom. Maybe it's friendly. <laughs> Maybe it is. <laughs> that was kind of scary. So I can actually spam pretty damn fast, but... It Messes my fingers. And let's fight the boss. What do we have? Looks like the nail again. Which is fine. Oh, look at him. He's attacking his own flies. <laughs> Hell yeah, charm tears. Yeah, chocolate milk does that. It gives you the stupidest tear rate, but you have to spam it. You have to, like, constantly be hitting the button, which is murder on your fingers. Which is why I tend to not pick up chocolate milk. Because I, I don't like murdering my fingers. I like not murdering my fingers. It's one of my favorite things to do. Not murdering my fingers. Okay, so we got a snack, which is health up. Hell yeah. Let's keep on expamalorin. Okay, so I can get it from there. Can I get it from down here? Well, this is a good choice for the secret room. But it's not the secret room. That's a shame. Oh, how did that not kill him? Okay, so do this the easy way. Hold on. You just download a program to make your key press rapid fire when you hold it down. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. That takes away the that takes away the game, man. Okay, so that was um, Anarchist Cookbook. Oh, check that out, Fish Head. Haven't seen that as a trinket yet. Eh, let's see. So I need two more bombs. That's what I need. I need to check this room. Oh, whoops. I was looking at my item charge and not at my screen. And since I'm not on camera, I can lean up so that I can see things. I need to, like, I need to find a way to tilt my monitor down 100% of the time. So I can see what I'm doing. Alright, let's give this a shot. Oh, give me the magician card. I don't want that. I want to keep my hermit card. Alright, let's leave. Let's get out of here. Ow, that was my elbow. Popping. Painfully. 
Totally need to build you need an arcade box to stream from. Oh, that would be awesome. That would be totally cool. Except for the part where I had to stand up. That would suck. <laughs> um, we need to figure out if this can run on one of the little Raspberry computers. And then just put that inside a... Uh, oh, that's awesome. I love Charm Tears. And then just put that inside a, an arcade cabinet. I don't know what this gave me. Oh, dear. Okay, so I have... Wow. Why do I have six keys? How long have I had six keys? That's crazy. Seven keys. Let's see what this room is. This double locked room it is a trinket farm. Hell yeah, let's take Faith up. Or actually, no. Let's take this. Let's take Lucky Key first, see if we can't stack up on keys. And then we'll uh, we'll go from there. Okay, so that was... Perfect. A seated arcade cabinet, yeah, for my lazy ass. <laughs> All right, I'm not taking the curse skull. So I'm going to hold on to this key for now, because I want to stack up on keys, and then once I've got plenty of keys, I'll probably switch it out for a different trinket. All right, let's see what this does. Looks like it is... Oh, man, it's Mom's Tears. That's awesome. Oh, look at him trying to blow them up. That's cool. I love the Charm Tears. They're great. With authentic abuse-proof controls. That would be cool. I wonder if you have a higher chance when you charge to get a, a good tier. Like... Oh man, why am I not just kiting these guys around? Okay, let's check this out. Um... Okay, so that wasn't... Oh man, Guppy's head. Yeah, you're mine. Guppy's head! Four days! Okay, so I have seven keys. Oh, Goathead, yes. So from what I hear, Goathead guarantees that you'll get a, um, a devil room, which is just awesome. <laughs> oh man, I love this pheromone. I love this charm effect. It's so badass. I've been, I have not been to the item room yet, so let's go there first. You heard my computer had a wooden processor. <laughs> Dude, my processor is an old, like, uh, Phenom 2. And my graphics card is like a Radeon 4870, I think, which is something from 2008. Oh, I'll take the quarter. I don't need to re-roll it yet. So, yeah, my computer is... It, it's mostly built with hand-me-downs, if we're being completely honest. It's mostly hand-me-downs. Oh! Yes! Oh, it's not an item. That sucks. But still, that is a chest. Wait, can I just, like, fly up? Oh my god, that's awesome! I can just... I can actually fly! I love that secret. That's so cool. So yeah, now you know why my computer chugs around. Because it has an ancient processor. Oh yeah, BOGO bombs. Because it has an ancient processor and an ancient... Um graphics card. Okay, so Black Candle has appeared in the basement. Nice! You might as well be talking about 5 4-inch floppies and premium 90 megahertz processors. Are you saying that mine equates to that, or are you saying that you don't know the difference, so you're just going to say that you might as well be talking about anything, because it's all the same? I can't tell which, which we're discussing. Hey, Carrion Queen. Oh, look at her. She's so happy. She's trying to attack her own butt. <laughs> She's trying to attack... Oh, God. She's trying to attack her own butt. Oh, nope. Link's Awakening style references... Style Room is such a great reference. Yep. It is good stuff. Wait, is that... That is a tinted rock, and I have no bombs. No, I have no bombs. I'm saying that both are so far in the past that it doesn't matter. Yeah. I know. Trust me, I'm well aware of how crap my computer is. 
like I said, it was made mostly from hand-me-downs. And, honestly, uh, pieces that were like a hundred bucks, it's, it's for the good stuff. I mean, if you want to stick around, I can tell you the full specs of my computer. It's terrible. The only good thing I have is a nice, fancy one ter or two terabyte hard drive. And I mean, what's a good hard drive going to do me if I can't run anything? Okay. This is taking forever. Can I just charm her butt to charm the butt? This is silly. This is silly. Stop it. So hey, like I said, if anyone wants to, to pitch in and get me a new processor, <laughs> go right ahead. What, what, in the butt. I agree. Why can't this be the carrying queen that shits out hearts? And why am I not abusing my, my headless baby? Does she get hit by that? Oh, hell yeah, she does. Why was I not abusing my headless baby? That's a much better tactic. <laughs> Can I just charm her butt? It's funny because the butts are usually the thing that's charming everyone else. Huh? Huh? I'm sorry, I'll see myself out. <laughs> so this is a much lazier way of doing things. Though now I guess I don't need to worry about her hitting me. I just need to worry about hitting her. God, this fight is... <gasps> oh god, so scared I was going to walk into it. Okay, so, torn photo, tears and shot speed up. Yeah, or we could just get brimstone. Uh, no, oh, why did I take that? I didn't mean to take that. Alright, um, I'm, I'm done with this. I'm done with this nonsense. I'm not going back. What, what? Charm the butt? Yes, so I now have Brimstone. And one Soul Heart. So I have to be careful. We're playing a very dangerous game here. Why wasn't I abusing my headless baby? <laughs> that is... <laughs> Binding of Isaac. Binding of Isaac. Oh, God. <gasps> I saw that coming, and it was just too late. It was too late. Damn it. Alright, let me, um, hold on. Take a quick break. Thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed. And, um, whoops, I was like, bar Isaac down. That's not what I meant to do. Anyway, I will see you next time. If you're watching this on YouTube, I apologize if the quality is bad or if the sound is bad. I'm, I'm still fiddling. Um, so yeah. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed it, do that whole like and subscribe thing, and I will see you next time. Have a good night, everyone. Bye.